pushing through at any point to see more damage he can do. He's been looking good on this jet, and he's going to look to try and get some of the opening kills here, but he takes a lot of damage. And someone, well, they've got it with the plant. The heal's going to come straight into Scream. It's Sky healing him up as much as possible. Doma's position is one that can be easily checked, but he can do some nice damage. He can keep him out of lamps for now. The fake tap on the defuse comes in. Shots start to be landed, and it's Liquid that'll pick up the opening kill. Now it's the battle back, but they're falling for the trap. Liquid was set up and ready for it. Someone needs to make a move, and they need to push up over this. You saw Scream. He flew up, drafted up high to get some extra information, but Chak, he's not going to win that. They're all around him, completely focused down, and now Bosa, he's going to play around this turret. Mystic's there as well to swing around at it, but he's only picking up one kill. It's already tapping away quite fast. Have they got this? No! Oh my god, Summon, they fought enough time! a lot of players if you're playing sky in your ranked games look at how these two are going to use sky it might be different approaches to it but we don't see enough of correct usage of sky in and out of games when we're playing right now and in terms of what someone will offer on this round well you do expect them to kind of run on and charge on forward against liquid here more flashes going through to see if they're going to get the sound cue for it like you mentioned Nick. spike will go down boast is nicely covered off here chat just sat back Ready to fire off whenever's needed. Poison's off. For Liquid, a three-man retake when you have less of a weapon. You don't hope much in here. Maybe you can try and grab yourself a weapon or two. But a setup again. And the one thing we always should be praising someone on is their after plant position. They play off each other so well. The problem is, like we saw in one of the games, the first game they played, right? That sometimes they can be made to feel uncomfortable if they can't get into those positions. But their setups and where they want to be and where they want to place themselves are huge. Exactly. Now, right in. So they, now they know that there's only going to be one player here. The rest of those orbs are going towards spawn. They know exactly where he is. Oh, they can't quite win the fight just Ooh. yet. There it is. Sight's clear. Hold wall that. goes up. That wall's being put down as a fake, but also it's there every single Five round. Play. So you can't tell if they're faking or if they're fully here. Scream, though. Old up online. Dashes out on sight. Takes a frag and now waits for his teammates. This is winnable for Liquid. They have ults online still. And there's the final one going out for Sky. The information Game. The player spotted, but Scream has to force the fight on the Stinger. Cryptic's there to save the day, but still a 2v2. Time is ticking. Liquid ain't got a lot to work with here. They have to force the fight quickly. Utility is gone. Scream got to be the one that swings out, catches the first, but they have no idea. Mystic could be waiting in bath to swing out and take them. They go for the defuse, and he takes a frag to put Scream on low HP with no time. That is an easy win now for Mystic and a fourth for Summon FC. Really well fought out round for Liquid. What a lineup. He was not ready for that and instantly he dealt with it. It may have been a headshot, but it wouldn't have mattered either way. Scream goes up high and Doma puts him down. More utility being thrown at them. And Link, he can't even escape. It's all going wrong for Liquid and Summon. They are just large and in charge, running and gunning Liquid down. Hides quickly before space is given for Liquid and time starts to run out. With 35 seconds left, there's a lot of stopping ability on Team Liquid. And honestly, at this point, it I'm seems like this should be their round. But look left. at the players oh, on B. Dead. They've got lockdown, but where it's going to be popped, they could get in there on time, especially with Echoes falling. Now they need to force the fight straight on up. And in fact, didn't even notice the Hunter's Fury was there for Mo. He pops it, destroys the lockdown, puts away his ult and peaks Cryptics. What an animal. There's a frag. There's the man advantage there's even viper's pit erected on the b site this could be it it really could be it this is problematic for liquid Solcast, he continues to go on the hunt he wants to try and fight off this results coming in but mystic backs away and that's the smart play right here and now oh no timing mystic he was hoping it may not be fired off this direction and they were stopped to counter out what had been used before and push on through i think at this point for someone fc you're pretty confident because Mystic, my man, is being escorted towards the depths of B long. They're clearing this out, making sure he's still going to be alive. And this is a really important fact. Look at how concentrated they are at their back because they have Mystic. They know that that B site is secure for them because he can throw over the snake bites, which are on their way now. Roman's got himself in a great spot as well. He gets the information to fight off. Also spots out Echoes, tries to spray up against him, but it's Soulcast that'll best him in that one. Liquid now in a 3v3, but that bomb is ticking away. Liquid still picking up a nice amount of kills. Mystic doesn't have to face it. He just about escaped in the nick of time. He's got the combat slim as well. He'll get the kill, and someone will get... Packs himself as far as he can. Oh, the shot... Oh, he didn't decide to fire it. He just lets it run out. That could have been a kill going his way, but instead it's Solkaz. 
who managed to best him as Doma was trying to sneak on forward that little bit further. Now Eccles being oh so cautious here, wants to try and get the flank on go, but again, it's the setup from Summon. They're ready for all of this. Chak straight away with the opening kill. No problem at all. He's got his ultimate out, and they'll get the extra information he needs. The Seekers, they start to seek out everything he needs to find, and he's just looking for one more kill up in it. Mystic's there to back him up as well. And again, Summon, they're in such a great spot. The fight's coming out, though, and that flash did not do wonders, but it's straight away both are coming out of bathrooms. They're being overrun and overgun. Once in time again, it gets close for Liquid, but it doesn't even... And into the A site, pretty much for free. Trying to find his way in, but Doma with a frenzy close range, and he's not done just yet. He will be finished off as he did have some low health. And finally, Liquid have an advantage in this as the plant starts to go down. Spike on the floor. Link got himself in the tube. Oh, he can get around that though. He's not going to be pushed out of position. His position is going to be revealed instead. He just can't catch a break. Now into the 2v2. Both players. Stuck Smash. out towards B long. Mystic can keep him at bay. That's a nice... It's, it's going to be damaged. Oh, it's huge. I didn't think it was going to beat him. Oh, it's so close at the end. It's so now at 10 to 3. Still very unlikely they win this, but there is a chance. There is an opportunity. They need to close this one out. Cryptics, he was in trouble from far away, and he still is. Luckily, the right click or NG for Mystic doesn't work out, and that will be 10 to 4, clean as can be. A nice flaw. I don't think they expect Mo. Boaster's going to get caught in the back if he goes through there because Solkus is ready for the TP. But now they come left. out, they see Mo, but a little bit too late. He actually has Hunter's oh! Fury. Got another frag out of there. He goes 25 HP remaining. Hunter's Fury online. Still a recon dart. Still a drone and shock darts. This could be huge with Boaster on the long flank coming in through Hookah. All he has to do is cause a big enough distraction. He's actually spotted out Sky and Solkus goes down. Boaster up now with a Vandal. Smoke going to last a while, but with Hunter's Fury... I just want to see him wait. Oh, the recon. He swung out wide, but it spotted the player. They know where Eccles is. He's going to TP to get out of there, but he got tagged up. He's managed to make it away. At least doesn't recall it, but they heard him. Surely they heard him. No, they didn't. This could be dangerous. Eccles paranoia up, pops it through. Going to look for the fight, but a free fire by Mo to win out the round. Summon FC, get the defuse and dwell. Block off a lot of this site, and there it is going in. But Eccles reacts perfectly. Look at this. Oh, everyone's taking double damage. He's got a Spectre in this round. Should be over and done with, but hold on. Look at the damage Summon FC are doing, and they've gotten to the site with the spike. Oh, he's trying to bait him out. He's going to go for the default plant if possible. Maybe, he's actually falling back with all this time. There's no players on A, but how fast can they really get there? Are they going to go for the double dupe? Mind games. Mind games all over the place. Oh, they're not working, though, because look at that position from Jed having already pushed down middle. They can see that, in fact, these players are not rotating. They're still outside of B, but uh, for a second, the players actually pull back, given an opportunity, but Scream, no, he just sprays straight through that wall, doesn't give it. Going down as well. Scream's already got his knives out, and this could be problematic, but he just about misses the timing right on the edge of it, but still finds Boaster. Not going to be affected by the Leer once again, only blinded for just a few seconds. Scream trying to make those knives work. He wants them to pop up. You know he's looking for a heady anytime soon. Can't make him connect. Now he's back on just the pistol. But Cryptix is there to back him up. It's working out perfectly so far for Liquid. But they've still got to hold on now. And the Scream, even with a ghost in his hand, he's just pistol whipping and shutting him. Scream on the site, trying to hold his position. He was very trapped down there. Nowhere to really go from it. He had to win that duel. And now some have got full control of it. The wall will go down, but Cryptic's battling back. It's a one-for-one -one trade off though, so they're still on the back foot here. Now it's about positioning. And again, we always praise Summon on their position for these afterplants. But Boaster's just sticking around fighting. Completely done for those two kills onto Eccles and Link and Summon. Reply. It's not gonna Most work. of rank do. <laughs> that's very true. Get out of my way. Dodges I've had because of it. Oh, that's a nice hold up in the air. Doma trying to catch an angle above the wall. Didn't find it, but Jack and Mo are the ones taking the kills. Doma coming in with the one taps to rival the, the jet on the other team of Scream. And a 1v5 now presents itself for the one tap machine. And of course, he's got a weapon that doesn't actually one tap most ranges, but it does there. Boaster down, low HP with a wall bang. Not even a wall bang, actually. Doma fell to his death, having tried to get down quick enough to avoid any further damage from Scream. He got down a little bit too quickly. 1v3, you know Scream goes for these, but with the time being so low, don't think it's gonna work out.
It'll be tough. They're watching for it. They're ready. And Mystic even wants to force the duel. There we go. Nice Nicely job. done. All right, twin. <laughs> we really well, have been hanging around each other too much. We definitely have to <laughs> <laughs> do everything together, Mitch. Ten seconds left. So, no players in the team, but they took control of the side. But that's nice on a round like this for Pistols to do some serious damage, but Soulcast is going to bring out his ult. Mo getting that kills allowed him to heal himself back up. They clear out the B site, but I feel like it's going to go up in mid to block out those middle pinks because these players are starting to push up. In fact, they go through the poison orb and come out underneath the tube where Solkus gets caught off guard. A recon dart about to go through. It lands in the center of site, clears up above, and clears into Kitchen Hall. But little do they know, there's already a player crossed over in the spawn. And as they drop cryptics, these players are going to swing. Link is the first to take action, but he falls right afterwards. And with an off shot, miss Scream has to run away. Five HP. Oh, hold on. No. <laughs> he tried to get an angle, and I think it was the right call. They could be locked down. Easily takes down Echoes. Pushed him away from the site. Now Cryptic's got to try and hold on. He starts off strong with the first kill, but there's so much more for him to find. He continues to spray as he wants to try and delay that spike plant. But as Bosta wants to try and move on forward and get these extra kills, the rest of his team were falling around him. Now it's all up to Chak. He does have the spike. He's got 30 seconds to play with. He tries to bait him out. But it's the wraparound he needs to be careful of. Oh, and he doesn't expect Link. Push through kitchen to make it work. The revive coming in onto a spike planted. And what better way to do it than putting it, uh, putting up that sage wall, guaranteeing the wall going up. And no doubt, excuse me, no damage done to the liquid guys as they fall back. But a man disadvantage now for them to defend against. Out of charge. Yeah, they may not have the numbers, but they certainly have the setup. Oh, the wall goes up against them though. Now they have to push on through it. Someone looked to try and take a challenging charge. They go in for the fight. Dova starting off with the kills they need, but that's all they're going to get for now. Enemy Mystic remaining. firing on back, and although Mo is there as well, has he done enough? They're on the hunt for the Sage. They managed to find him, but they're going to play around the yellow box. He tries to get the heal on and get himself up into full health, but they're just playing cat and mouse. He's running around non-stop. He's going to sit on the defuse, but it's not going to work out. And he doesn't even get the kill as Link played that too. He's come in and back him up. And they watch the sage fade away. Standing ahead. Oh, it got a tag off, so they know some angles are clear at least. Mystic grabbing himself the opening as they push forward and try to force Team Liquid into showing their hand early and not run that clock all the way down. Boaster swinging on the right side. Quick shot looking for more, but Cryptix denies it. The Spectre's still able to do a lot of damage. Here's the setup coming through from Viper to block Vision and Echoes doesn't stand a chance. Seems they want, but Echoes, he's already thrown through his, both of his snake bites. He's staying aggressive because he's popped his ultimate. These players are going to need to make a move quite quickly to get on in and deny the utility that's still up for Liquid. As oh. you can see, oh, Eccles, he's grabbed a kill for free. You're not even supposed to get them with the ultimate, but he does it <laughs> twice. And that can have the post plants and no one gives the opportunities away. Solka's losing a lot of his HP in the process. Tag's coming through from the Hunter's Fury, and a lot of the guys are low now from Team Liquid. Not just the HP, but they've lost a lot of armor from that tag up as well. But they're happy to just play passive because of that res and because of that lockdown. Summon FC having already wasted their Hunter's Fury are going to really struggle to deal with those ults. Summon now need to make the numbers in their favour, but it's not working out for them. They're the falling the for the trap. Liquid in the background. The lockdown isn't destroyed. Doma is detained and he is seen. soon to be killed. Oh. There we go. Yeah, that... They off of here. But he also needs some backup and he needs it sooner rather than later. As more of the liquid players are starting to make their way to him. He's heavily outnumbered. Straight in with the kill. Heals himself back up. Wants to stick around for the fight. He's spraying them all down. And this is, this is perfect. Scream on the hunt will finish him off. And Scream says, you cannot play Arena against me. I know exactly how that goes. My boy. My man. The Mystic Man. The Mitch Man and Mystic Man. On the line is a candlelit dinner with me at the next land for Mystic.
my favorite Viper. And a 1v2 to try and close this one out. You said Scream obviously took that fight. He won it, but he was so low after that fight with the enemy Reyna. And unfortunately, uh, unlike when he's playing Reyna, can't heal himself up. He's been spotted. And he hasn't spotted Mystic, who's now creeping up. This angle might not be expected so late on after it's just been cleared. There we go for the first. And with Scream being so low, Mystic could actually clutch this one out. Down goes the Poison Orb. He taps it. He's going to get it halfway. Scream wants to get in there and go for the right click. And that's what closes it out. Two of the best teams in Europe. And they are giving it some welly on the summon side early on. But they're going into a three-man stack. Dober posts himself up high. He slaps them down. But his teammates are falling around him. Echoes toying with the sides of the smoke. Doma on the hunt for him. He'd already done a lot of damage, but those flashes come through in the nick of time. It's Boaster and Doma to finish this off. But Link on the Sage, coming round with a flank, trying to see if he can get something done there. They may expect it. Oh, Doma instantly uses his head. They're fighting off, and it Boaster needs to be careful. The heal's coming in for Link. The Battle Sage is ready. The Spike, oh no, it's so far away. Mm-hmm. It's uh -huh. problematic, and Post doesn't have much to work with. With that wall going down, maybe he picks up another classic and tries to break it, or he just knives it down. So the thing about this wall is it actually stops you from worrying about a flank. Oh, sorry, it means you can exclusively worry about a flanker. As you can see, movement back towards middle. Link is clearing this left. out. Now he knows, okay, there's no way Boaster is anywhere else. He should be long, but the wall is still up, and you can see that on the mini-map. So Link needs to be very careful. He should be aware of that, but he comes through, tries to get the flank on. But now, how do you get into that spike? That wall is still up. You've got to wait for it to break or help it along the way, but it's going to take quite a while, and I don't know that he even oh, has the no. time. He's going to be worried about being pushed in the back seven seconds as he pushes forward and goes for this plant but he has to stick it then oh maybe he'll go up for the fight but no he gets it all the way down just in time 0 0.08 of a second i read it as left and he sneaks his way over into garage link has no idea boaster caught off by the right clicks a headshot for link and a round win what a way to start off haven Clutch. I didn't even get to say because you took so much time at the beginning before we got into the first. Now, of course, it's then tripped once that push comes through. But Doma, they expected him to be close. Do they expect these teams to have already pushed right up through Garage Aftershock? In effect, Mo with the kill. And Summon FC with a 2v4, a tough one, with Echo still on the back of the site. Oh, they're not going to check it. Easy first kill. He should expect another player there, though. Mo very low on health. Won't be able to do any damage from here. Okay. Pistols galore, and they also have every ult, uh, with the exception of Skies, which was burned up in the last round. So you're going to be pretty confident in winning this, winning this one out without even deploying ultimates, I would imagine. But if it gets a little dicey, Ooh. I like the attempt by Cryptics there. Get up close to Doma so that he's scared to yeah. hit himself with it, but he wasn't. He was not deterred. So this is going to be difficult either way for someone. They're already on the back foot, but they didn't have much invested. At least getting a plant down again is going to be helpful. And Scream in with the straight kills. Headshots galore. And like we heard from the desk, right, this is much better to see Scream test of a bad situation for Liquid, right? Someone commit the ult, they push on in. Scream had already tagged a few of them up through smoke, but then was out of position. He manages to miss the ult and still get a kill. And now he's still alive to push back into this. The rest of his team are around him and they can push off the back of this. They're gonna have some extra information and Scream picks up another kill. He's online, he's activated and he is shutting Summon down. Mystic is gonna try and escape because the attacker caught Killjoy has come in at the same time. It's a double Killjoy to try and play off the back of this. Link expects this, he's ready and waiting. He wants Mystic to push on forward. Oh, oh, nicely done by Mystic. He faked the Perfect TP, patience. but they, they knew what was happening, and yet they still fell for it. They still lost the fight. Mo, he's in trouble at this point. He's blinded up. He can't do a damn thing, but there's no time. There's no time left. Mo's just swinging, and it's gone. It's done. It's coming out, and they are scared. Liquid, they can't get a full read on this scream. <laughs> he manages to get a kill on the post. The post would have flashed him. And he was flashed out himself. Chat decides to push on through, and he'd already taken a lot of damage there. Time was not on their side, and they needed the site control. Doma trying to hold on and make it last. May have just bought enough time to get this spike plant in, but they hear it, they jump off it. This round's gonna get started anyway. And that's a strong spec to kill. Soulcast overruns completely. Full force coming in. Echoes on the site. He smoked out, does avoid. 
being tagged up for now. Trying to play off the side of the smoke, and he was tagged up, but not fragged up. He even gets away with a kill before going down. Spike planted. Link may be able to use the revive finally in this one, as Mitch is desperately trying to find out if he <laughs> used it yet. I don't think he did. I just I just looked through really quick. I don't think he did at all. But the problem is, look at the position of these bodies. They have to drop down the site and go for a res in the open, or take long control where there's two players tucked in. That res is probably just going to be used as a bait if it gets used at all. The problem as well is that Mystic is here. There's the paranoia going through. That's going to slow it down. The nade costs them even more time. Liquid really being pushed out of this when they have to use Jet to get in there, but Mystic shuts him down. Now an ult from Doma to close it out. Cryptix has gone really well handled by Summon FC. And I believe, James, there's only one player to defend it, and he's about to be overwhelmed by numbers. Mo needs to hold on to this. Starting off with the first with the big pickup. The Tiger starts to cut and jump at him. He's still dealing with him well, but Echo will eventually be able to get the kill. Jack went down as well, which is less than what they needed here. There was a good chance for Liquid in this round. They've grabbed some weapons, they've grabbed some chances, and they've given Scream a phantom to play with. There's Two a flag. Three. It's gotta be it. It's got to be yeah. it for Boaster, really. He's got the fault line. He's got double flashes and one player up in heaven who was thinking about backing out, but Mystic stuck around. He's going to take this heaven fight alongside his teammate Paranoia for default, but a slow push from Boaster. He doesn't oh, want to give away that he's here. The time is so, so slow. They're starting to wrap into heaven themselves. Flash for lower, get the kill, but now they've got to worry. Hold on, they can actually stick this if Boaster gets the cover out there. He's got to worry about the heaven oh! player. Shuts down Solkus. They try to peek on through. There's no time. Mystic got baited, completely baited into coming off the spike. Oh, that's devastating. If he had have stuck it, he would have gotten it. Scream has a potential victim to his right. Boaster still in the position, but he oh. spotted him. He's seen him. Scream looking for the headshot, but he didn't hit the one tap this time. Spike has been put down, though. This is where Liquid now need to make the magic happen. All the weapons are there in favor of Summon FC. Mystic, he tries to get rid of it, but it's not going to work out. Liquid abide as much time as possible, but Doma's gonna land the key shots. All of Summoner there, and they've got the superior weaponry to deal with all the players left on Liquid. Two more left to find, and Scream Snipes find a low success. One kill going the way for Cryptic, but that is all he's gonna get. A summon secure. The C here could be deadly though, as Mystic stuck towards the back of the site. He's gonna be flashed out, but still gets the kill. Oh, and he's locking him down. Headshot delivered. Mystic is looking to stand strong and stand long. Jack is there with him all the way. And it's an easy finish. This would be the time to pop it. And I guess Jack's just waiting for the score, We're waiting for them to say, okay, now is the time to strike. Right in the corner, it is what's expected. And now he's just got to bide his time a little bit longer. The attacker Killjoy comes out as well. Is there a gap in it that they can play around with? Scream's landing himself with crucial kills. And the rest of the Liquid boys now need to be very cautious. Out of charge. Check, check it. He needs to check. He has to look to the left. Oh, oh no! And Cryptics! He bests him with it. Dome is stuck in the side. He's completely detained. But Mystic, he creeps on by. They're all flanking and Cryptics could have never expected it. The but time is this is gonna be hard. Doma lands the key headshot, but Solkas is gonna stay alive. Just long enough. Solkas with three. And if you're all take seven to charge, jump blink. That was a headshot. But the Phantom on range, remember, within 30 to 50 meters, there's 140 damage. So that player now survives on 10 up close, hoping to force a fight, <gasps> and he gets taken down easily by Link, finishing off his food. The jump up. The attempt, but it was stopped. Liquid, they didn't want to be in overtime, but can they get the all-important round? Oh, the battle back, and it's Boaster leading by example. Headshots delivered, and the spike soon to be planted. Scream looking to sneak on through, but Boaster does it again. A headshot. Oh. Through the box. He ults on through, but Cryptix pushes it, but it doesn't even matter. Pause finally disappears, and we are ready to go. Team Liquid need this to stay alive and push to another OT. And you can see Summon FC now on the defensive side get some aggression up on A long. Mo had some backup, but they decide to, well, back up and leave the A short completely open for, or mostly open for their opponents after that smoke, I'd imagine completely. That's a smarter decision here as well. Wait it out, see what you can do. 
Oh, Boaster! He did it in the last round and was just hitting mad headshots. And now he's just taken Scream down, who was ready and waiting for him. Link's got no chance getting the revive in. He's walled off right side now. That's where Boaster was. But Boaster's fully committed, so he's going to force him off. The plant can't come in. He's buying more time from over and over again. This push can be coming oh. at any time. Boaster, he's an absolute madman. He's a monster. He's pushing on forward. He's dominating Liquid, and this could be it. It all could be over. And Boaster is just hitting headies all day long. The 14th round is secured. Defenders win. And summon FC. Right. And that's why you'll see Liquid now go towards A, which is a bit more open. Less opportunity for these Bucky to deal some serious damage. But they've got to be careful still. Oh, he misses the first shot with it. And they're backing away. They're not going close range for it. They don't want to deal with it. How many Bucky shots does it take to kill a turret? We're about to find out. But Boaster, he's looking to land some key Bucky kills. The flash comes on through. Oh, Jackie was saved by Mystic. They're getting it done. The Bucky's are pulling it off. And Mystic gets a... Green, the point man in middle. But he's all by his lonesome. That nade from Doma. Going to push him back a little bit. Delay some time. But it won't do too much in terms of damage. As the rest of the team blitzes on the B. Boaster full blind. But it's returned. Luckily, though, Solkus is able to survive excuse me long enough to take the kill and put it into a 5v3 planted. it's the force up into force up bucky power came out of summon that might be all they have in this because it's a 3v5 now jack trying to get some information using the turret the smoke's going to delay the opportunity for that He's waiting for someone to try and give him something to work with here no one's actually on the bombs, but what? <laughs> Link just catches the rough end of the stick there. Boma's still trying to fight it out, but there's too many Link. So they don't have to waste any utility initially. Uh, no smoke or anything to go for that early peak in case of something like an op. Now they've spotted out one, but they have no idea about the killjoy. Oh. So Solkus is caught off guard. Even though damage is done to Mystic, he's still able for another. And now it's a two-man advantage for the defenders of Summon FC. Liquid have lost every foothold they had on this A site. And the remaining three players are left considering whether they should even go for this. Yeah, that looked like it was going to work out perfectly for Liquid. But instead, there was more players on the site than they ever expected. Okay, Mystic's a little bit low. They can try and work in. But look how many corners they need to check for this. The setup is so strong from Summon to defend the site. Chat gets flashed out behind the screen. But he's got the cover he needs. Even though still goes for the fight. Mystic's there to back him up. It's 25 health and a dream. That dream is staying alive and still getting these kills, but Link, he has other ideas. He wants to turn this in favor of Liquid. He may be low himself, but they're in a really good spot now. Spike can get planted. Oh, it's up to Summon to try and play on the retake. The ult's going to be committed. They're all going to be thrown off their feet for now, and most just playing from up above. Ooh, the ult. Committed. Oh, he gets put down, and Link! Headshots! The Execute's going to come in towards the B site. Nade timing a little bit off. Mo looked like he had a oh. quake gun model for a second. That spam through the wall almost catches some. And look at the snake bites. They completely have put a halt to this push. Great use of the Viper for now. But Mo has fallen down the back of the site. B is the spot for contention for now. A Mystic playing on the edge of the smoke. Builders, you know, the players are real close. Oh, but Solkas doesn't go for the spike bomb. Wants to create some more space, and instead he goes down. Mystic is still fighting, and he's getting all the kills that Summon need. Beautiful stuff, and he can just teleport away. Boaster's on the flank. He's got the Bucky still for sure, but he does also have the pistol in hand. Oh, they're going to run straight oh into him. God. Oh, no, no. No! no! Oh, God! Oh, oh Boaster! <laughs> He knew they were going to push him, but he thought they were hiding in the corner. So the idea of the flash was to allow his teammates to peek, but it ultimately cost him what would have been a free kill. That's a shame. Look at these nano swarms going out again and again. 25 seconds. Mystic has no choice but to push towards the site because he has to pick up that spike. And he's just about made it away. Now TPing on A, and a plant will come through. Oh, this round has been so huge. Another TP, a counter, and Link has to be cautious. He has to be careful, but he's just sticking at the balls on this man, and it's going to work out. It was pretty much his only option to win the round. Oh, he fakes out the TP. They might now think he's underneath if it wasn't being checked by Mystic, who's already on a 4K pursuing the ace. His teammate peeks, and Jack was 1 HP, but he gets away with it. He survives, not even a bullet connected for three for summon, and... It does go up. Needs to make sure the timing's on his side. Headshot has been seen. 
A boast is there to help him out as well. Just in the nick of time, the communication is on point. Oh, and Mo is ready for it. Liquid destroyed for now, but Eccles, he swings round to find Boaster completely unaware, but they might not check Mystic now. And he starts off with the first. The spray continues, but Cryptics, he's able to free frag it out. Liquid will now make their way towards the A site, which is still actually defended here. It's not an easy site for them to push into, and Doma is sat down below. One corner gets checked. The blast pack comes in, the nade is going out, but the ult is going to be committed as well. Doma trying to make it out, but it's the double raise ult. They take each other down, but now Cryptix is all alone. Was it a trade that was all for nothing? Cryptix needs to make some real powerful play come in. He's working his way around. He wants to play the guessing game. Doma types in quake mode, and that's certainly what it looked like. The rocket launcher showstoppers fire it off. Swarm grenade goes out and the alarm bot's also triggered. Cryptix is playing mind games with him. Straight up into the fight. He gets one, but Mo is too quick on the second. Plenty of time for the defuse and finally two rounds posted together for Summon FC. Push comes on in. They start to bust their way, but no kills found just yet. Liquid still defensive. Ooh, Mo! Still getting away of that kill on the screen. He just about stood on a stayed alive and then was able to bounce back out of it. Boaster might be able to force some aggression in here. Push it on forward, but he's found by Eccles. Left. With no spike going down just yet, Liquid had to take these fights. And so far, they're managing to win it. Eccles' flash has come up huge. He pokes out into Mystic, forced his teammate away, and now Doma is all alone. Oh, that new box being placed there as well. That literally saved them, but that nade is going to force them off the position left. again. They're running out of time. If Doma can delay it one more, it could be huge. And he hits the headshot onto Solkas. He expects Spike a flank planted. coming round to him. But it's not coming through just yet. These last two players are low. Doma has got the opportunity of a lifetime. He's still got two blast packs to play with as well. Slowly going down the ropes. He's got to check all the corners, all the angles. Might see the gun. Oh, no, he's been spotted. Cryptic's had a look at him, and they're going to be able to ring around him. No one's going for it just yet. Oh, 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 oh. What is that? Absolute madman. Paranoia slows down the plan completely. Oh, oh. Most started off with the opening kill. Someone, they've ransacked this B bomb site. Scream's doing his best to fire off some shots, but Doma throws back some of his own. And now Eccles, he's all alone. Up in the tower, and he gets a headshot. But can he get some more? Three more players to find, and two are low. This is not impossible. But already the flank, and Eccles, he's well aware. One tap and a dream, and he's still got this flash to play with. Breach is sat behind the box. And Eccles is being careful, he's checking it all out. And Mo, well, look how far he's run away. These lineups are here for days on the side of Summon. And Eccles, he hasn't got a hope in Hell's chance. They're one step ahead of him. And that's Last all. Player standing. Eccles still getting the kills. Doesn't matter. There we go. Time to fire it off. It won't connect. And now Dome was going to bring up one of his own. Oh, the ult coming up, made the land for a bit of time. He wants to fire it off. Oh, and Eccles, he extends too far on that one. But has it been done enough? Quickly turned up. In the game, Solkis comes up to help and try and save the day. Blast pack for a kill. Scream with another, and Solkis oh. keeps on giving. This push is heavily delayed now from Summon. So this could work out quite well. No players being detained, and Solkis through the smoke. That is to get rid of Mystic, and this is huge from him. The old pop by Solkas as well. They're pulling it out of the back. He's on a tear. He's ripping him down. Remaining. This is incredible. Solkas, a man that was said to be on the bench, well, certainly doesn't deserve to be on one right now. He puts an end to him, and Scream gets the final kill. Totally, yet they're sneaking forward, and this sneaky play. I mean, I'd be surprised if Link can even survive this when the flash is popped. They see the nade. The flash doesn't oh. hit him. He has a chance. One looking for more. A second, almost a third, with Boaster being on one HP. And that's a ridiculous miscalculation by Summon. It cost them the map by the looks of things. One misplaced flash, and it all goes to hell. I, I
I need to see that flash again, Mitch. I don't think it was misplaced. I think it was somewhere he was sat. Because he was looking right at the corner of the bit that pokes off the wall. Mm -hmm. It's 13-8. It, was an it didn't look like from someone FC that the intention is towards the A site. They're rotating in through mid, coming up in spawn and about to take a hefty fight onto the jet. Just now hiding inside a smoke. Hold on, this could be an opportunity screen. Biding his time, but maybe waiting a little bit too long. Solkas catches oh. Doma. Eccles on the reload, looking for the right clicks. One, almost the second as well. One HP, and it's easy. Does it for Eccles. Possibly react out and grab a couple of kills. You know what Scream can do. And he catches you off guard. No flashes just yet. There's a free one. Smoke down and he can easily get out of here. Dashes just to make sure that he's safely with his teammates. His life is so valuable. You do not want to lose him. Uh, considering the weaponry the rest of the team has. Oh, and he's dealing more damage as well. Mo gets picked right up. He's seen some more of a boaster from the side. Link's able to save the day on that one. And we'll get the Vandal upgrade to play with. But someone with only two one players left remaining. alive and still these Spectres able to put some work in as the summon players get closer. Jack is all alone. Oh. He's not got much time and he's not able to fight it out. And Liquid are taking their time. They're not going to overextend into this just yet, but it's allowing more smoke to go down, more positions to be covered. Mo now trying to work the advantage. He knows they're coming from up above. He's got the lesser weapon, and it's going to be harder for him to fight it out, but he still walks away with one kill for now. More to be had, and they're coming close range. Mo and Doma, they're making it work. Stinger plays for days, and he gets another one. And another one. And from Summon. I think it's the right move, though. You don't want to get what? caught off by the pistols, but Eccles, he's just sprayed straight through the smoke, killed Boaster, dropped the spike. That's pretty huge. They know it's a full A commitment. The rotate's on the way from Killjoy, or at least it looked like it was. With so little time left, they haven't really got the option to rotate over. Here's the spike planted. Turret and alarm bot retracted, but Doma, he's finding another kill to work with over here on the Summon FC side. Mo catches Link off guard, and a 2v4 emerges. Hunter's Fury still online to deny any sort of uh, defuse. You can see that Mo is on his way down a long. And at this point, I think Liquid should be considering the save. They'll see what they can get done. Maybe even get an ultimate to be popped, but they'd have to clear underneath. And that, whoa, there's a wall bang. Mystic was 20 HP, but Jack is here as well. Shutting down one, shutting down two, and putting two on the board for some. A more defensive but attacking setup here on short for Liquid. They're ready for this hit to come through. One player close on short towards the tree, and the other player in garden. And it's Scream as well. He needs to hit the shot. He needs to land it. And the bait and switch works. Doma was busy. He went to check it, but Scream was alert and ready. Something you can always rely on here for Liquid. And this is better. Link up high. They push through the smoke. More damage being done. And even Cryptic's going to get one with the turret. I got the spike. But that's not what you want to see. In a situation where they need to hold on to these kills. That's it. I mean, they, they dropped the spike with 12 seconds left. There's no way Boaster goes in for a 1v3 in those conditions, especially when you still have Rolling Thunder. It's going to be post-plant usage. You look at mid-control completely in favor of someone FC, and rather than break Mark the door, they are heavily pushing in towards spawn. Link goes through the smoke to find one, but that's all he gets. And now Cryptix wants to do the same, but they're watching for it. Boaster knows exactly what's happening, but they're still, po they're still pushing the B site. They've left A. Oh, wow. A is completely open, but they have no idea. Dealing with them one at a time, the player in the back of the site, Solkis, he sprays away, oh! drops the spike, but it can be recovered, and they can just run to A with it, a 1v2, and a tough one at that, because the player he dropped wasn't the Sova, so again, that Hunter's Fury for Mo is still online for the post plant, so Solkis has very little time to get in here and pressure them in with a defuse. And remember, for looking at this, he still has to be oh so careful, left. even trying to get back into this fight, because he needs to check all the corners, there could have been a player still lurking around, a 1v2 with no information to play off of here. He'll maybe try to just get some extra information. He's back online with it. But Soulcast, this is a big ask of him. Clearing all the corners. Got to check all the way to short. Is he going to win out this duel against Mo? Oh, they turn! And Mo still manages to land it. Soulcast goes down and it's really the turret spotting players already coming down middle the dash from screen used more aggressively this time as he's in the B connector but they know it now maybe they didn't uh -oh. they seem uh -oh. unaware Eccles pushes out gives the support Mystic down this is huge from screen ultimate popped but the player's already dead he'll spot the final the leg scene no more updrafts unfortunately 
Bubba with his ulti in hand, a 2v1. It's looking like this is going to be their round for Team Liquid to close it out 8-4. to four. All they have to do is deal with Shaq, a man with a stinger in hand and a 1v2. But he has lockdown. If he can just cross over, pick up a weapon, and get onto the site, the lockdown could be invaluable. Already on the flank as well. Going to try and wrap around Shaq and keep him locked in because Shaq knows if he can at least isolate one player, he can play the guessing game. He's checking every corner. He expects Scream to be close. But Scream is just around the corner trying to hunt him down. Oh, there we go. Information to be had, though. Shaq will now get the alert. And have a good understanding left. of what could be going on. Not a lot of time for Chak to make a decision here either. And he's going to run straight into the trap. Remaining. Cryptix is there, but he goes down. Game on now. Scream versus Chak. 15 seconds to go. He's not being quiet with it as well. Scream is fully on the hunt for him. Remember, Scream popped the knives ages left. ago. Chak is trying to use as much utility as possible. He's got his ult online at the same time, but it's where he can safely plant it. Only just about getting the spike down. Swarm grenade's gone down. The ult committed as well. And Scream has to go in for the kill. He's going to have to do it now. 22 health left for Chak. He's looking to try and save the day, but it's not going to work out in his favor. He easily kills away with the lockdown. And Scream saves the day. And this is a test of stamina for a lot of these teams as well. Playing a full best of five. Straight up into it. Mystic with a frenzy. How's he getting away with that? Has to drop the reload and Cryptix will finish him off, but maybe he's done enough to help his teammates out. Solkas, he tries to be sneaky. Comes a bit late to the party, but now he's put it into a 2v2. Doma with the frenzy. He's making it work. 40 health left and Doma finishes. Then they just caught a little bit. Both are seeing one player, but that's not a lot to work off. The door goes down almost. They're trying to bait it out. Chances. They're trying to say the post has run away. With a Bucky, he can do so much damage here. Oh, no! He misses the first shot. Scream and Link overrun him. Jack is there as well, left. but he can't stand up to that. Mystic trying to work his way through. But the Bucky's this time round won't find success. Spike Liquid planted. looking for their temp as the spike goes down. And it's only Mo that remains. Bucky in hand that he wants someone to push him. He wants to find himself a better weapon to fight off in this situation. But for now, Liquid are just going to stick to their ground, hold their positions, and grab themselves a 10th round. Yeah, especially when you're in these kind of buys. If you lose one or two players, it means the next round isn't really a bonus at all. It's a, it's a full buy. You know, because you're investing so much already into it, or you're coming in with a massive disadvantage. The right click from Mo, a good attempt. It does some damage, but not enough. And of course, the spike needs to be good for more than one. They need to potentially line up for him. Echoes is the first one forward. He's low on health, but he still wins it. No, Mo falls at the first hurdle. The smokes are going down. The turrets dealt the damage to, and Scream pushes on forward. He's up high with the knives, but he still can't get the kill. Jack's aim has been razor sharp. Throughout this entire series, he's been hitting some big money shots. Planted. Still three players to find, and with Doma with the operator, it's not the greatest of weapons to retake with. He'd have to pull off something special. The liquid players are all in the site, two back in Boathouse for now. It's all a waiting game on how someone wants to try and approach this. If someone gifts Doma an opportunity to take the shot and land it, and pokes out into the open. Maybe they can try and push on it. Oh, it's doubled up on. They just have to stand there. Mystic's taking a tiny bit of extra damage. It's not what he wants to see. Cryptix is spraying them all down, and Doma will be the last to fall. He can't get it done. And Liquid... down. He has cover from Doma while he's doing it. They try to push him. They try to stop him, but they can't get anywhere near it while Doma's spraying away like that. Everything about that round was perfect from Summon FC, but now we need to see them do it again. And it relied on an ace. You can never re rely on repeating that. Oh my God, oh. Scream. Stop it. A double peek comes out of mid and he shuts them both. Solkus in with a uh -oh. double of his own and Banks, this may well be the end unless Mystic has got a 4K up his sleeve. Scream just said... Doma, anything you can do, I can do better. And Mystic, I think, has just been spotted as well. Nice headshot onto Soulcast for sure. But he's now got to deal with Scream. The money man headshot is...